Did you know it's actually possible to save Takamura in Cyberpunk 2077? Yes. You probably did because we did it in our live stream two days after release, but without spoiling anything, your decision to save Takamura or not will change the ending. The change is rather dramatic if you choose to side with Hanako for the Arasaka Corpo ending. Otherwise, it only makes a very tiny difference when the credits are rolling. You can find the Corpo ending linked below if you're interested to see how it plays out with Takamura still alive. But to save Takamura for yourself, it's really simple, even though the game misleads you. So after the main quest down on street, you will get the quest Play It Safe. Before you start this quest though, make sure you bring with you some non-lethal weaponry or blunt melee weapons if you're doing a no-kill run. It is possible to sneak as well, but it is rather difficult to do so. Down on Street is the quest where you attend the Japanese Town Festival, and you need to take out the three snipers in order to kidnap Hanako. After you kidnap Hanako, you will then regroup with Takamura in the quest Search and Destroy. This is where you have the option to either save Takamura or let him die. After you get swatted by Arasaka, you will get separated from Takamura and Hanako, and what's interesting is that the game gives you one objective, to leave the building immediately. In fact, saving Takamura is not even an objective. Last chance to get the f*** out of here! Takamura! You can't leave him back there! Forget him, guys, toast! Unless you want to wind up like him. Johnny understandably encourages you to get out and leave Takamura to die. But you can see we've fallen through the floor from the building Takamura was actually in. Keep blowing, I 360, they're in the hallway. Now instead of following Johnny out of here, you're gonna go to the left through this little hidden gap here. And then you can start sneaking through this next section. Now if you want to sneak through, you've got to wait here until that guard turns around. And then hide behind this sort of... Uh, container here until they walk past which does take them a little while so i'm just gonna go ahead and start killing them all it is also possible just to run past them all literally just running to the end the fuck you doing you lost it he's beyond any sort of help johnny's gonna carry on trying to tell you to go back but don't worry just carry on going ignoring him completely doesn't care about that Corpo Takamura, even though I think at this point in the game we do own him one. You then get a new objective come up that actually allows you to go and save Takamura. So you've got to fight your way to the end of the corridor in this super dark environment here. And then you can come in and save Takamura, but there's going to be a ton of enemies in here to kill. And here's Takamura. You should not have a return. You will die here with me. Thank me later. Need to find a way out now. Fast. There are empty rooms to the right. It's our only chance. So then you literally just need to follow the quest objective over here to the right. But obviously there are even more guys. It is possible to do this stealthily or you can just go ahead and run down the corridor. There's one door you'll find here that's open. Run through the open door to the right with the green above it. And then we can go ahead and drop down to the next floor. And this is actually going to take us out of the shopping center just here. Active in it, brother! Shit. Be careful. We must go different ways. Alone, we have a better chance. Really? Think so? Then go. Now. And that's all you need to do. Now the game will cut to the motel and you would have saved Takamura for the rest of your playthrough. And if you want to see how the ending will play out based on you saving Takamura, I'll have a video linked below for you guys to check out. Thanks for watching this though, I hope it helped you out on your own playthrough. Please do drop a like if it did, and of course you can subscribe for more cyberpunk guides. I'll see you in the next one.